So right there, something's wrong. It's dropping speed. SK3606 as a positive battery in one as a collector of the transistor. So I lose momentum here. Actually I'm not. Let's accelerate again. So I lost speed and accelerate again. So it looks like it, it adjusts itself to the the battery charge. <coughs> so this one that I'm convinced, I am not convinced it's going up at all, maintaining, because I know right now 1261 is a platform, so to get to 60 would take a little while. And, and because if I let it rest, go to 62, and as soon as I put it to run, it goes to 61, I know it just dropped right there. But I would expect to be in a 61 platform to 60 about for maybe two hours. So if I tomorrow morning see 1261, we have a total success. Uh, but I don't think it's going to happen. I mean, it's, I think it's running too fast. I measured uh, before what was the speed, uh, how much current consumption. It was about 8 milliamps. But definitely with the configuration that I have here right now, I have four pulses, which I never had it before. I only had two. So this is unique in a certain way. Looks like accelerated. So the speed now is 1211. So it did accelerate. <coughs> and I assume this big battery is about. 12 yeah so it hasn't lost anything the only battle losing anything is this one just this small guy here that's the only one losing anything And I could change the configuration of the magnets to prove it goes down pretty fast, but I'm not going to do that this time. So I just saw 1260 right there. And that's what I'm talking about. If you wait for one hour, maybe two, definitely the 60 mil will drop. So this is the. It's been ready for an hour now. So I expect to see 1260 soon. But nonetheless. This is a much better configuration that runs for a long time.
come on, show me 60, so I can stop the recording. I'll wait tomorrow morning.